welcome back to Fallout. God, it's been a while. It's been a long ass while. I'm very sorry for the long delay between episodes for this. Uh, like I was saying last week, I wanted to finish Hotline Miami 2 and Grim Fandango, which I managed to do, and it was great. They were both really great games, really fun to finish. Uh, but now this week we can focus back on cities. We can focus on uh, Fallout and eventually completing Fallout um, and maybe some new stuff as well. Great. All right, well, let's get into it. I'm back here in Junktown. I left. Uh, I was at the hub when we last uh, left off. I'm here in Junktown uh, looking to hopefully become a boxing sensation in the wastes. Uh, we need to speak to these guys, I think, um, to get our uh, career going. Hello? This is Gustafer. And uh, we also have... Oh. Sorry, no boxing today. Ugh. Okay. Oh. Okay, there's no boxing today. Uh, we have a tough-looking, muscular man here who is... Hello? Yes? What do you do here? Uh, Sol laughs heartily. Why? I am a boxer. <laughs> ah, I can kick your ass. <laughs> what's the deal? Hmm, what's the deal? Hmm, well, stranger, I work for Gizmo. He's the owner of that great casino there. Pays good money to fighters here, too. What else do you want to know? How did you become a boxer? I was always getting into scuffles with my brothers when I grew up. One time a small band of raiders attacked Junktown, and I beat one into submission before he could get his gun on me. Just lucky. Uh, just luck, really. But Gizmo was sponsoring organized fights, and I needed some money. Been boxing ever since. Ah. Huh. Can, can you tell me about your boss? Gizmo's casino is where everybody goes to gamble. There are many games, and you can have a great time. It's the best place this side of the hub. God, why do you marry him? Jeez. He's, he's not that great. I talked to him once, I think. What else is there to do around here? If you're just looking for supplies, you should try Killian Darkwater store off southeast of here. You can also get a night's sleep at the crash house near here. If you're planning to stay a while, uh, you might want to get a drink over at the scum pit, but watch out for the skulls. Uh, tell me more about the casino. Gizmo's casino is where... Okay, thanks. <laughs> it's the same thing. <laughs> okay, thanks. Oh, okay. So there's no fight today. What's what's your deal? Junktown peasant. What are you doing here? What the hell are you doing here? I'm here to I'm here to become a boxing sensation. This guy's not letting me. Hey there, no boxing today. Try again tomorrow. What time tomorrow? Can you let me know? Talk to Gustafa if you want to bet. Okay. Uh and this guy. How do I what time is the boxing? What do you do here? A tough guy, eh? I bet I could take you. My name's Mike Tyson. Just take... Should we try to pick a fight with Saul? A tough guy, eh? I bet I could take you. I'm Saul. Um... Well, nice to meet you. Later. Okay, I guess, um... God, that's a really good way of defusing somebody, actually. Uh, okay, fine. Boxing tomorrow. What time is it now? And what day is it? It is 10 o'clock in the morning. Um, okay. Let's wait till tomorrow. Rest until tomorrow morning. Six o'clock. And then maybe we can have our chance in the ring here. Okay, we're back. It's six in the morning. What's up? So, you want to lay a bet on the fight? Uh, we've got better things to do with my money. Goodbye. Um, no thanks. Mind if I ask a few questions, though? Sorry, I don't have time. Maybe later. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, there he is. Look, he's up in the ring. Okay. Uh, fine. What are the odds? Who do you want to bet on? Saul or the challenger? Odds favor for Saul winning. Cost is 25 caps to bet. You get 50 if you win betting on Saul. 100 if you win betting on the challenger. Well, Saul's going to friggin' win, isn't he? Like, every time. Unless the challenger is, like, a super mutant, which I doubt it is. Bet you the challenger is just going to be, like, a junk town peasant or something. I'm going to I'm gonna bet on Saul. All my money. Would you like to wait here until the fight starts at 2? Oh, God, yeah, okay, fine. Sure, what the heck? Oh, shit, okay, let the fight begin. Oh, shit, who's this? You see Desk. Is this guy's name Desk? No, it's not. Oh, my God, they're really wailing away out in there. How do I get in on some of that? Oh, he's punching back. Come on, Saul. Come on, rough him up. I got money on this. If this guy kills Saul, I'll be so upset, and I'll have to go in there and single-handedly um, dispatch him or dismember him. And then beat him to death with after the dismemberment with his own... Oh, there, okay. 
So, well, well, looks like you're a winner. Here's your caps. Oh, fantastic. Did I just win 50 caps? Awesome. Sorry, but today's match is already over. Oh, well, never mind. I know. I just watched it. I wanted to ask you some questions. Can I get in here and talk to Saul? Hey, Saul. What do you think about your big win? I can't get there. Guys? Talk to Gustafur if you want to bet. Okay. All right. Well, I guess I can't become a boxing champion then. I guess it's just a way to make 50 caps every day or every every day there's a boxing match. No? Should we just open up on him? What the hell? Maybe if we go talk to Gizmo? Let's go talk to Gizmo. Oh, man. It's nice being smart, though, right? It's nice being able to have, like, conversations with people and stuff. Gizmo's in here somewhere. See up, like... Oh, did I talk to this guy already? I'm sure I came in here to talk to this guy at one point. Who are all these dudes? It's a roulette dealer. Oh, shit. Can we play roulette? I put it all on black. Place your bets. You currently have 3,483 caps. How many would you like to bet? I I'll bet five caps. <laughs> Sorry, better luck next time. Do you want to play again? No. <laughs> what? I didn't even see what it landed on. What the hell? It's just like random? Like, oh yeah, you won. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. All right. Uh, what's up here? Oh, whose room is this? Hey, who lives in here? Uh, I guess this is like Gizmo's um, boudoir. Gizmo? Got anything to say to me? Get out of here, you asshole. Gizmo, the casino owner, has just called me an asshole. And... And Izzo doesn't want to... Did we anger Gizmo at some point? I don't remember. Or did we try to talk to him while I was dumb and now he just um, assumes that I'm dumb forever? Alright. Because uh, there was something to do here around Gizmo and Killian, wasn't there? Killian Darkwater? Should we go speak to Killian and see if there's any... Uh, like to be shed on the situation, Killian? I'm in junk town and I'm ready. I'm ready to do stuff for anybody who needs stuff done. Who's this? It's bed. It's junk town peasant. What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. What are you just doing standing in that stupid room? You could be out here talking to this guy by a barrel filled with fire, warming up, having fun, hanging with your friends, not being a jackass, no? Okay, fine. He's just gonna sit in there and just do his thing. That's fine. All right. Dark Waters, General Store. Here we go. Man, there's not that much to do in Junktown. I thought there'd be like a whole bunch of stuff to do here, but I don't know if we can actually do any of it. Killian? How you doing? It's Killian. Well, howdy. Hi. What can I do for you today? Uh, who are you? The name's Killian. Killian Darkwater. Uh, yeah. I'm the mayor of this fine town. Oh, shit, he's Mike the mayor? Movie. I'm Mike Tyson. I want to buy something. I don't want to buy something. What the hell? I better go. Is that it? <laughs> Can I not do anything here now? That's kind of annoying. All right. What do we actually have to do? Status. Vault 13, Shady Sands. Oh, Necropolis. What's in... Oh, we fixed the pump already. The hub. Find the missing caravans. Who do we need to speak to next? Doesn't say. Brotherhood. Become an initiate. I've done that. Excellent. And Shady Sands. Stop the rad scorpions. Uh, okay. Oh, shit, we could do that. Okay, fine. <laughs> I guess. I mean, there's nothing else to do here, I don't think. Uh, I've, I'm pretty sure I've spoken to everybody. Um, Gizmo's calling me an asshole. Doesn't want to talk to me for whatever reason. I can't become a boxing champion. I can only watch Saul um, probably just win every fight that he ever gets into, which is kind of dumb. Uh, so I guess I'm, like, shit out of luck in Junktown, unless, like, I'm missing something. Uh, I mean, there's like the hotel and stuff. We can always come back to it. Is there like anything up here? What's in there? It's probably just like filled with junk town peasants. Let's go uncover like the seedy underground of the life of a junk town peasant. And we'll like follow them around with a camera. We'll document their lives and everything. We'll see like what kind of cabbages they eat out of dumpsters and everything. And I don't know. Do like a... We can have like a part with sad music and stuff and say like, oh, Junktown peasant sadly got the clap from eating a cabbage or whatever. What's in here? Can we actually just steal stuff? Oh, there's nothing. So this, okay, this building's like totally empty. Whoever lives here, maybe this is Saul's house. God, maybe we can go in here and, oh God. Okay, fine. Saul's still just standing there. All right, fine. We're out of here. We're leaving Junktown. I thought, I thought we'd be able to find fame and fortune in Junktown, but uh, I guess not. Shady Sands? Oh my god. We're like heading all the way back to the start of the game now. Uh, in some bid to like 
gain experience. Because the thing is, last time I played this, we couldn't do anything with those super mutants at the lab. They were way too strong. They, they like one shot me pretty much. Remember they like ripped dog meat apart with one shot and everything as well? Oh, here we go. All right. Uh, we have rad scorpions. We have many rad scorpions. Uh, do we want to use this or actually we probably want to switch to our brass knuckles for these guys because I don't think they're very strong and we can conserve a bit of ammo. Know what I'm saying? Yeah? Okay, fine. It's brass knuckles time. Pow. We don't have any action points. No problem. Oh, shit. We need to... I think we need to speed up the combat speed too. I think we can do that. Oh, my God. Poor dog meat is getting like absolutely owned back there. And so are we, actually. Look at this. Oh, it's dog meat just killed a scorpion. Save some for me. Okay. Where is this now? Uh, there's a combat speed. Item height. Subtitles. Oh, we can switch those on anyway. I don't know if we need them. Language filter. Combat. Oh, cool. Violence level. Entire highlight. Combat speed. Okay. Let's speed this up a bit. Apparently, this is like a thing. Text delay. Affect player speed. I don't know what that does, actually. Okay, fine. We go with that. See what happens. I see everything can go faster now. Pow. Not me. Oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, they're going a little bit faster. Okay, that's good. Means that their turns like end quicker too. Oh my god. And they kill me faster. Oh my god. Dog meat's attacking like that. God. Dog meat is out of control. Okay, fine. If we can one shot that guy, we need to stay tied with dog meat. We can't let dog meat kill me. Oh wow. Yeah, he's moving a lot faster. Okay, that's better. All right. This one's my dog meat. Great. Tied at two. Whew. That was close. Do we want to steal their dildos? Probably not. Uh, let's save our game uh, while we're out here. Yes. Mike Tyson and... Okay, fine. Rad Scorpion's down. Something tells me we're going to see many more of those in Shady Sands. Oh, it's going to be nice to go back to Shady Sands, though, right? It's going to be nice to get back to Shady Sands and be like, Hey, guys, remember me when I came out of the vault? I was dumb as hell. Now look at me. After I've had uh, some surgery, I'm really smart, and I'm the best, and everybody loves me. Hey, what's up? Remember me, Seth? What can I do for you? I want to know about the Rad Scorpions. Take me to the Rad Scorpion Caves. Oh, let's uh, see about the Rad Scorpions. Those damn rad scorpions have been after our Brahmins since we moved here. Not a week goes by that someone doesn't get poisoned trying to keep them out of the pens. Last week they took my brother Jarvis. Uh, Razlo, our doctor, is looking for an antidote as quickly as he can. Hey, if you have the means to help us, why don't you talk to our leader, Aradesh? Oh shit, yeah, I forgot about Aradesh. Okay, uh, take me to the rad scorpion caves. I think I can handle this. Are you sure you want me to give you the directions to the rad scorpion caves? I can't go, but I can show you the way. Yes, thanks. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Okay, here we are. All right, dog meat. A new adventure is upon us. We have to rid this cave of rad scorpions, apparently. And it looks like there's only one. It's the Oh, no, there's not. Okay, there's there's many. But it's still... Oh, okay, there's some down here, too. All right, dog meat. Let's get down here. What kind of treasures will we find in these caves? Oh, shit. They move really fast now, too. Pow. Look at that. He's in a big rush just to get up here and get owned. That's right, dog meat. I'm taking all the glory this time. I'm going to tell all the people in Shady Sands that me, Mike Tyson, am the best. It's still kind of dumb, uh, evidently, by the way I'm talking. But fine. It's still... It's like aftershocks from the surgery. Dog meat, no! Dog meat, you're such a show-off. Stop it. I want this kill. I want... It's... No, oh God, it's 1-1. One, one. Fucking believe this dog. Seriously. Okay, fine, dog meat. Let's run around down here. What's this? What is this even? All right, fine. Let's take it. It's like a box of ammo. Maybe somebody in Shady Sands will need that. What's over here? Is there, like, any cool stuff over here? Some bones. Oh, you think these might be horned kangaroo bones. But you cannot be sure they are too weathered to make a final determination. Oh, if only I had more skills in the Bear Grylls area, I would be able to tell. Maybe I could pee all over it and make it into, like, some sort of hat or something. That would be cool, too. No? Okay, fine, dog meat. Let's carry on. We'll press on up here. Uh, up here. There you go, Mike. Good job. And up here, too. You might as well. Oh, there's one over here, wasn't there? Oh, man, this is so easy. I think we were supposed to do this at the start of the game, but I was too much of a wimp to do it. And also, I couldn't talk to anyone because I was so dumb. All right, fine. I'm moving into range. I'm going to one-shot this scorpion before dog meat gets here. Come on, dog meat. Don't even think about it. Let me do this. Yeah, there we go. One nothing, dog meat. Eat that. Okay. Or, or don't. 
Okay. Do we need to take any of this stuff? Do we have any dildos? I mean, it'd be nice to maybe just have one dildo. Do we want one dildo? Oh, we've got two dildos. It's all right. Fine. We'll just tell them, even though those aren't from the scorpions down here, when we get back to Shady Sands, we'll be like, yeah, killed them all. Look, I got two dildos here to prove it. And they'll be like, oh, shit, this guy's carrying dildos everywhere he goes. Uh, scorpion? Do you not want to tussle? Oh, yeah, he does. Okay, fine. Oh, man, these guys hit for nothing, too. Look at this. Pow. Is it going to be another one nothing situation, dog meat? I don't think so. Don't do it. Dog meat, don't. Don't kill it. Dog meat, please. Dog meat did it. Oh, one nothing for dog meat. I can't believe it. I am so embarrassed right now. Oh my god, look at this one. It's a little bit bigger than the other ones, I think. Is it bigger? Oh shit, we could have snuck up on it. That would have been cool, right? A sneak up uppercut right into the butt of the scorpion. Pow. Man, I'm hitting so hard too. I feel like I should be one-shotting these things. Oh, dog meat just comes in and steals all the glory. Dog meat, that's not nice. Look. Oh, okay. We're in for it now, dog meat. There's like a million rat scorpions here. Okay, I'm moving in. I'm wasting some action points. I'm expecting a one shot. It didn't work. All right, here comes dog meat. Old glory hogger himself is coming in for some more glory hogging. Great. Okay, thanks, dog meat. Fine. Um, I guess the uh, combat speed effect character thing was. Um, I'm gonna do that. Look. Yes, affect player speed too. Okay, now I'm gonna move fast in combat as well. Or not. Oh, it's because we're not in combat. We're in combat now. All right. Do we move fast? Oh, my God. Yeah, we do. Okay, fantastic. Look at this. Oh, this is much better. Okay, great. We'll actually not have to wait 10 years for a fight to um, to solve itself. Oh, shit. Dog meat. Come on. Every time. I always open up and I deal tons of damage. And then you just turn around and steal all the glory, you son of a bitch. Pow. I can't do it. I, I don't have enough action points. I think I need improved hand-to-hand -hand, uh, before I can do more, possibly. All right, dog meat, you ready? That's right. Have a taste of your own medicine. How does it feel, eh? To have the glory stripped away after you've worked so hard for it. I think I have to move in on this guy. I think I have to move in again on this guy, if you can believe that. Pow. Okay. Oh, man, here we go. All right, dog meat. You're not even going to get a chance this time. Oh, shit, he might get a chance. Dog meat, get out of here. You're not allowed to follow me anymore if this is all you're going to do. You're such a troll. Jeez. Okay, fine. That was close, dog meat. Have we done it? I wonder if we've done it. Oh, shit. I wonder if it's just like a... You don't get like any like Zelda sound effects in this game, though. That's the only thing. Like, I feel that now that I've done this, I should get like a thing that goes... Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, hang on. You gain five for stopping the rad scorpions. Oh, look at that. You gain 500 experience points for stopping the rad scorpions. For slaying your opponents, you're... Okay, so I didn't get a do 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 but I did get a little message to say that I have indeed been successful in eliminating the threat of rad scorpions. Man, Eridesh is going to be like, oh shit, I remember the first time that you came into our little town. You were so dumb and I couldn't communicate with you and now you've come so far. You're not so dumb anymore and I, now I can communicate with you and I can say... Thank you so much for ridding us of the rad scorpions. And here, take all of my money. And I'm going to be like, oh, shit, yeah, Erdesh. Now you're broke, punk. Me and Dogmeat are going to go live it up at Gizmos. No? Okay, maybe not. Where is Erdesh anyway? He's like in here somewhere, isn't he? Who's in here? Good day. Hi, how are you? I, uh, I just solved the uh, scorpion problem. Oh, shit, it's a bathroom. I can't believe it. I can actually go in there and take a bit of a poop. Should we save our game? I feel like, yeah, we should. Who is this guy again? You see a short, stocky man. You see one of Shady Sands' guards. Oh, my God. The Shady Sands' guards. This is this is Tatooine, isn't it? We are on Tatooine right now. All right, fine. Tatooine. Where's the Skywalker Ranch? Also, where is Owen and Camilla Skywalker, whatever their names were? Is this Eridesh? It's a cook. Is this Eridesh? Yes, it is. Okay. <clears throat> Eridesh. Ah, things What's are much up? more settled now. Yeah? Raslo has been working on a cure for the rad scorpion poison. Yeah. And with that, we should be able to fight what's left of them. Huh. <sighs> you don't need to worry anymore. I destroyed the nest. You are truly a hero. I know. Know that the people of Shady Sands are most grateful. It'll help me sleep very well tonight. Thanks. Can I ask you a few more questions, though? Certainly. What do you wish to know? 
What's going on around here? Ah, things are much more settled. Oh, I know. It was nothing, honestly. Certainly. What do you wish to know? Nothing. Thanks, boy. Oh, we've done it. Erdesh has given us nothing, though. What's this cook have to say? I'm too busy to talk right now. Go get this meal ready. Okay. What? The guy that needed healing was in here, right? For the antidote? Maybe I need to, like, talk... No, I can talk to all these dudes now, though, can I? Who's this? Razlo. It's late. Come back in the morning. But I need your help. Are you hurt? Yes. Great, Brahmin. Why didn't you say so? Uh, I did? You're barely hurt, you wimp. Come back in the morning. Oh, my God. Razlo just owned me big time. Oh, I fucking can't believe it. Okay, fine. Wait till the morning? No problem. If I can remember how to wait till the morning. Let's wait until 6 o'clock. Shall we? Man, I love the system of waiting. It's so good. Every Fallout game has it too. Can I help you? I need healing. I've been poisoned! I have a sample of the rad scorpion poison. Can you do something with it? Let me see the sack. Excuse me? I don't... Razlo, I'm not ready to show... Yes, I can do something with this. Done. Here. Take this as a free sample. It seems to work well against rad scorpion stings, of course, but it shows much potential as a general anti-venom and poison cure. Done. Thanks, Razlo. Fucking sweet. I gained 250 experience points for helping make the antidote. Can I help you? Uh, I have a sample of rad scorpion. <laughs> Let me see the sack. Oh, look, he's doing it again. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is he just like converting my dildos into... Do I have dildos now? Oh, are those not actual dildos? Well, they're sacks. Where... Has he just, like, obliterated my dildo collection? Because... Oh, fuck, he has, too. He's made these. Okay, so... If I bring dildos back to Razlo, he converts them into antidote? That's cool. You look distraught. Are you in need of assistance? I need... Um, sexual healing. My husband, Razlo, can help you ask him. I don't want him to do it, though. Uh, Razlo's wife? I wanted you to do it. Damn it. Who's this guy now? Pale, wire young man. Hello, I'm sorry, but I'm not feeling too well right now. Please, if you can help find a way to fight the rad scorpions, talk to my brother, Seth. I've already done that. I wonder if I can doctor this guy now. I've got better doctor skills than last time. What does he think? He can't figure out what is affecting this man. Oh, shit. I can't believe it. What about first aid? Let's first aid this guy. This man is suffering from a virulent poison. Okay, let's give him some antidote. I wonder if we can actually do this. Can we actually give him the antidote? That'd be sweet. I have to go all the way down here, though. Uh, let's use the antidote on this guy. No. Let's use it here. Okay. And then we'll switch to the antidote. And we'll... Oh, no. You have to do this, don't you? We'll do the antidote. Did that help? You gained four... Oh, look at that. Over the next few minutes, the man shows definite improvement. You gained 400 experience points for curing Jarvis of his poisoning. Oh, it's Jarvis. Thank you so much for helping me. My name is Jarvis, and I'm Seth's younger brother. Please, if there's anything you need to know, just ask. Can you tell me more about your brother and why he keeps ripping me off? Seth's a very good fighter. He's very determined, a little too much sometimes. Still, he's devoted to the welfare of our village. Tell me a bit about the town. Well, Shady Sands was founded by a great ancestor of our current leader, Aradesh. He could tell you more of the story. We have a well and irrigation, so we do well for ourselves. Holy shit, that's crazy. Just chatting, thanks. All right, Jarvis. Oh my god. So, the people of Shady Sands now think that I'm like the fucking best, right? I should probably go speak to Seth, because I've done this thing for him. I've done like such a good deed. I cured his stupid brother, and I got rid of all those stupid rad scorpions, and it was easy as hell. Holy shit. Our entire town is grateful to you for destroying the rad scorpions. Thank you. Oh, what can I do for you? I want to know about this place. Shady Sands is a peaceful community. We have our own irrigation system, so we can grow our own food. If we were not plagued with raiders and rad scorpions, we would have no problems. I want to know about the rad scorpions. I want to know about these raiders. Oh, shit, I forgot about the raiders. There are several groups of raiders. I organize guards like Ian to help fight them off. There is one band to the southeast of here. Watch out for them. Oh, nothing else, thanks. You should speak to Aradesh, our leader. He likes to meet all of our... I've already spoken to him, Seth. He didn't really have much to say other than he called me a hero. I thought you should know. All right, guys. Holy crap. Okay, we're back, and we've actually done some stuff. If you can believe that, wow. Okay, 
Let's talk to this stocky guy. Let's see what his deal is because we've, we have never talked to anybody in Shady Sands before, which is crazy. Let's talk to this guy and see what he has to say. Hello, stranger. You look like you're new here. What's your name? My name's not important. I'm Mike Tyson. Good to meet you. I'm Ian. What do you do? Oh, it's Ian. I uh, was a guard for the merchants of the hub. However, I was shot during a raid by bandits. I've been staying here since the people have helped me recover. Still, my knowledge of the outside world... Um, and my experience make me useful here. Shady Sands is my home now. Occasionally, I even get to visit Junktown or the Hub to do some trading, since I'm the only person here who has ever really left town. Oh my god, really? I'm sorry to hear about your inter injury. Was he injured? Where's this Hub and Junktown? Oh, okay, so this is like how I get to other places. So I've like played the game backwards, basically. <laughs> Could you help me out a bit? Your experience would be useful. Oh... Could you help me out a bit? Hmm, tempting offer since this place gets boring. Tell you what, standard rates, 100 caps and you've got a deal. Oh shit, is this guy going to come with me instead of dog meat? Deal. Let's go. It'll be good to get back into action. Done. Oh, you gain 100 experience points for convincing Ian to join your quest. Oh, I have a dog and Ian. Oh my god, I have like an army now. I've got one of these dudes with blue jeans following me. Oh, this is fantastic. Holy crap, this is awesome. Okay, great. Well, coming back to Shady Sands, turns out was pretty good. Uh, we'll be back uh, tomorrow. We're going to do one of these like every day now until we finish this game. Similar to how we did Grim Fandango and Hotline Miami 2. Uh, because my plan is to finish Fallout and then move on to Fallout 2. I'm kind of looking forward to Fallout 2 because it's apparently a very, very good Fallout. Um, or so everybody says anyway. Not to say that Fallout 1 is bad, because it's not. It's been very, very fun. Uh, but I'm looking forward to getting through it so I can uh, move on to Fallout 2, and then possibly Fallout 3, and of course, now that Fallout 4 has been announced, uh, I'll be playing that as well, uh, which is a lie. It has not been announced, but I'm hoping that by the time I finish all of the Fallout games, Fallout 4 will be coming out, because it's got to come out, right? Is everybody hopeful of this? Me? Only? Just me? Probably not? Okay, great. Excellent. All right. Well, like I said, we'll be back, uh, and we'll go. Um, we'll go beat up some um, mercenaries for Shady Sands tomorrow with the help of Ian and uh, our dog as well. Awesome. Great. All right. Well, as usual, thanks for watching, and see you tomorrow.